Now let me show you how to take care of your pads. When you finish with the treatment and you want to take the pads off, do not pull on the wire because if you pull on the wire, it will make this come loose and then the pads won't work. So grab the pads and pull it off your skin. And always make sure your skin is clean before you put the pads on. So if you have lotion or cream or makeup, clean your skin first. After you take the pads off, don't put it down on the table because the adhesive pad itself will pick up all the dirt. So always put it back onto the protective gel that comes with your system. Okay, and then put it back into the bag. Now, a couple things. If you find the pads don't stick as well as you like, or you find it starting to give you pins and needles sensation, that means the pads are too dry. So you need to moisten them. So get yourself a glass of water, dip your finger in the water, and just rub some water over the gel surface. Wait about 10 to 15 seconds, the moisture will be absorbed by the gel, and then the pads will be sticky and conduct better right away. So very simple. Now those are disposable but reusable pads. You can reuse them about 100 times, sometimes a little bit more, sometimes a little less, depending on your skin condition. If you find they don't stick anymore or they don't feel good, it gives you, you know, pins and needles sensation, then it's time to put new pads on. Now to change to new pads, you just pull the wires apart Get yourself some new pads or new electrodes and just simply plug them in just like that. And you're ready to go. Very simple. So take care of your electrodes and it will take care of you. My pink therapy system is safe to use uh, even if you have diabetes and if you're on other medication already because there's no chemicals involved so you can use it safely uh, as often as you like for as long as you like with no side effects and no worry just feeling good